Have you ever felt? Are you listening? Hi again, everybody. It's really good to have you back on my channel. And if you're here for the first time, then welcome. I'm Sylvia and my Style 5 is where I'm delivering 5 nuggets of style defining inspiration with each video for all those of you who are interested in fearlessly expressing yourselves through your style. So if you're interested in finding what your style is or just developing and elevating your personal style or if you're just on the lookout for some inspiration then please consider subscribing and then you'll always be in the loop with my new uploads. And today's topic is spring coats. Because winter is finally going away, at least it is here in Amsterdam, you can finally feel spring in the air a little bit and now it's the perfect time to say goodbye to our thick winter wardrobe and say hello to our lighter spring one. And without further ado, let's go into the jackets. Now my first recommendation for spring is a wool jacket. And it can be a really thin one, like this one from Zara. This is a really soft peach-like fabric and it is really thin though. So a jacket like this you would need to be wearing with a sweater or anything warm like that underneath. Or you can go for a thicker, longer wool coat like one I'm going to be inserting right here and this is my absolute favorite for those first days of spring when you know winter is not quite sure if it's going away or not it's still quite chilly outside and I wrote loads about this coat on my blog last week so go right ahead and read that blog entry after you watch this video if you haven't already these coats are my absolute favorites because they are so feminine and so beautiful and elegant and this is actually why I always recommend that you have at least one wool coat in your wardrobe and they will be your go-to's whenever you have a bit more of an elegant event or even for day-to-day -day work it depends where you're working of course but for example for the office a nice elegant tailored jacket like this one will definitely make your whole outfit and it almost doesn't even matter what you're wearing underneath because your jacket is just that fabulous. My second jacket recommendation for spring is a good old trusty leather jacket and a biker jacket like this can be actual leather or faux leather of course depending on your preferences. If you do opt for real leather though I urge you to <laughs> shop vintage if possible because first of all it's more eco-friendly you're not encouraging the production of more leather items and second of all um, good old-fashioned really battered biker jacket is always going to be in style like really it's never going to be outdated so it's a really great investment of course maybe you spend a bit more on it especially if it's really quality vintage but then you have it for the rest of your life and the number one reason why I love biker jackets so much is their versatility they go with literally everything you can pair them with a very sleek urban modern look you can pair them with more rock and roll one you can pair them with even a very girly very elegant look just to bring that little bit of an edge and a bit of an unexpected element to the look and I think they are absolutely amazing for spring they will protect you from the rain they will protect you from the wind so you know what more can you want from a jacket <laughs> and my choice right here is from ASOS this one is sold out but I will link some alternative options in the description below another really great jacket for spring is a good denim jacket mine is from Evisu I told you guys about it I showed it to you in my Amsterdam vlog video I will link it somewhere up here if you guys haven't checked it out already and I think denim jackets are absolutely fabulous for spring they have this sort of nostalgic feeling about them because for example for my generation you know when we were growing up we would be wearing a lot of denim jackets so it just has that very I don't know warm and familiar feeling about it and you can of course opt for a very modern silhouette denim jackets are super in style again as is the whole denim on denim look or you can go for a really vintage feel jacket or for an actual vintage jacket you can go for those really big voluminous oversized ones mine is a bit more cropped and a bit more fitted because that is the silhouette that I personally prefer and also because I wear a lot of high-waisted skirts and pants and a jacket like this stops just where the skirt begins so it creates a very beautiful silhouette and a crop jacket will always draw attention to your waistline if that is something that you want to do now denim jackets come in all sorts of shapes sizes colorways fits so there is something out there for everyone and they are again super wearable of course maybe you won't want to wear them to the office but you can definitely wear them to school you can wear them to university you can wear them over dresses you can wear them in a very very casual outfit if you just 
can't even <laughs> that day. So yeah, denim jackets, a must have for this spring if you don't already have one in your wardrobe. Now an absolute must have for spring, at least in my book, and something that you can really invest in is a good quality trench coat. Something like this will actually withstand any sort of inclement weather, wind or rain or even bout of snow because hey, spring. <laughs> you will not feel them through a really good quality thick trench coat. And this is my absolute number one choice when it comes to spring outerwear, when I want to look very feminine and polished and put together and maybe even with a little bit of a retro flair because those trench coats have such a timeless air, you know, they'll never go out of style. They were as fashionable in the 50s as they are now. My personal suggestion is that you first of all buy a really classic trench coat, you know, cut above your knee and in a neutral beige or sandy or camel shade and then you can just go wild and buy more trendy pieces with interesting cuts or with really crazy colors but do make sure that you get your basics down first because a really classic trench coat is something that you will be reaching for again and again and again you can wear them in so many combinations you can really dress them down and make them super casual and I've seen trench coats looking really good with just jeans and converse honestly they can look amazing or you can really dress them up make them look really really upscale and then you can basically wear them to any sort of fancy event and last but certainly not least I recommend that you keep a blazer in your wardrobes for spring as you can see this one again is a really really thin one it has a barely there lining but it is still really good for those days when it is quite warm outside but not really hot that you could just go around in a t-shirt and nothing on top my choice of blazer is from Zara but literally everybody has them so every designer every high street store Every seller actually stocks blazers because everybody is buying them. They are super trendy and oh, by the way, they are really, really on trend this spring and summer. I don't know why because I've honestly never stopped wearing them, but everybody seems to have gone a little bit more blazer crazy in 2018. And especially these sort of longer, more masculine cut blazers, they are really in style right now. And blazers, just like all the other jackets that I've showed you so far, can be dressed up or dressed down. And my personal preference is to pair a really nicely tailored masculine blazer with a very feminine fancy ball gown. Because it's that contrast of masculine and feminine that really makes it work. And it's also a bit of an unexpected combination. And I'm thinking that now with prom season coming up, it might be a really good combination for you gals. So then you can also look very trendy and also stay warm health first so guys this was the video for today i really hope that you found it useful and that it will help you next time you are out and about and looking to buy a new spring coat and of course as always i enjoyed spending my time with you and i really enjoyed sharing a bit of my wardrobe with you guys and showing you what i'm wearing what i'm liking this season what i think is fashionable and what i am spending my money on <laughs> and thank you for spending your time with me as well thank you if you got so far if you did enjoy the video don't forget to drop it a big like so then i know that you like this sort of videos and i will keep producing more for you and until i see you here again have a fabulous time bye <laughs>